What I have here, guys, is a Muchi M1B. This is a sneaky peek cue. It's the Purple Heart model. It's a really pretty four-point sneaky peek. Ordered this cue from Budget Billiards uh, last week. And uh, on their website, it says now that it, this cue no longer has the Muchi logo. And the reason I ordered it is because the older Muchi Sneaky Peets didn't have the logo, and they were more like a true Sneaky Peet. It still has the, the black dot on the shaft, but I can live with that. Uh, you have a lot of options when ordering from Budget Billiards. This one, uh, I got the 12 millimeter shaft. It's a, that's the uh, Ultra Skin, the Super Soft Tip. And uh, I came with a free case here, too. Uh, put it together and hit with it a little bit. Uh, it's got got that classic Muchi feel. I've got another Muchi Q that I've had since I was 16 years old. Um, had it a very long time, since like 1991. And uh, don't really play with it much anymore because I, I'm afraid I'm going to damage it. It's kind of like a family heirloom now. I've had it so long, and it's in it's in excellent condition. But uh, got uh, got this one now, and. Uh, the lady at Budget Billiards uh, sent me a shipping label, and I'm going to send this back to them. And they're going to send me the one that doesn't have the logo here sometime this week. So the next part of the video will be the new queue, the one without the logo, and uh, got some uh, got a new table too. Now this, this will be the first video that I post on uh, with my new uh, table. This. This is, a, this is an 8-foot uh, Steepleton. It has uh, Simonis 860 cloth. And the, top, the pockets are a lot tighter than my old table. Um, barely get two in there in the corners. So we'll get to that. Okay, finally received the uh, Sneaky Pete without the Muchi logo. Here it is alongside uh, my old... Uh, 233-1 that I got when I was a kid. Um, pretty cute. Still plays good. And here's the laminated. It's uh, the black dot bullseye shaft. Done quite a bit of playing with it. And uh, going to include a, a video doing a circle drill with it here. So there's that. And we'll get to the shooting part.